now that all the speedway and hub world nonsense is done, we shall go back to the regular levels, which is a shame, really. Okay, not really. And we shall begin our conquest with Hurricos. We've always had trouble with the gear grinders, but now they've set up force fields to separate us. If you can find diodes, you can use them to turn off the force fields. I think there's a diode around here somewhere, but my eyesight isn't what it used to be. Hmm, a diode. A diode. Where can we find a diode? Oh look, I found a diode! So yeah, as you can basically tell, we're helping a bunch of nerds get rid of the bullies. Happen to be excellent robot makers and stuff like that. Windmills, destroy them all, even though that serves no purpose. Everything must be destroyed. Everything. Hello. Our robots! And robots apparently release spirit particles as well, because robots are living beings as well. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? Ooh, a rainbow! And mice! And gear grinders! I don't think it is. Yep, careful. You can actually die if you fall into a bottomless pit, believe it or not. In any case, here's a little sequence breaker. You can get up there before you can actually get up there with objectives and everything. And you can go over there. However, that'll be done later because... Eh, I don't know. I'll show you the proper way to get here. Hello. Yeah, charging at them doesn't do much. Robots don't know. Ah, mice do replenish my health. And some more diodes and some more gems scatter around everywhere. Everywhere we go. Alright, anything interesting here? Just a bunch of windmills and... Ah, the evil pillars of soul trapping. And a lot, lots of more souls to trap between the evil pillars. And windmills to destroy! The destruction of windmills is imminent. Resistance is futile. In any case. Oh goody! Bonus area! <laughs> Ah, leave that guy alone. He gives me objectives. Oh, these gear grinder thieves keep taking our lightning stones. If you can replace them all and activate our generator, I'd be very grateful. This is a lot harder than it sounds. Actually, it's just annoying. Grab the electrospheres or whatever they're called, I don't know. And place them on the pedestals where they produce power or something, I don't know. And all you have to do is wait for the gear grinder to show up. So yeah. Not much to do. Wait for the alarm. Wait for it. Wait for it. Keep waiting for it! And keep waiting for it! Wait.
Wait. Okay, seriously, where are you? Ha! Huh. There you are. Ha! Huh. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, wait. There's another one over here. Ha! You have to be quick, otherwise they escape. However, they do drop the electric spheres with them, so you can always place them back. So yeah. Gears, gear grinders can really grind your gears sometimes. But no matter. You will eventually get them. All. Alarm. Alarm. There we go. It's always good to focus on one side first because that way you know where the alarm is coming from. And where are you? There you are. Fortunately, the gear grinders possess an absurd lack of intelligence. So they just stand around and juggle the spheres. Alright, now that six are done on that side. There are four remaining on this side. Which just happened to appear out of nowhere after we placed the spheres on the pedestals. Out of nowhere. Let's see. Wow. They're really smart. Really. I mean really smart. I can't believe you fell for that. I can't believe I didn't get that on the pedestal. There you go. Okay, seriously now. If you're all gonna go for... That one and... Ah, the last one is always a... Ah, a bit of a pain to get. And he disappears into thin air. Or hammer space. Ah, excuse me for a moment. In any case. Sorry, no can do. Now then, that should be probably it. Should probably be it. Just this one here, and... Let's see, everything's activated here, I think, I hope. Let's see, dip. You, you don't say anything. Let's see, anything I'm missing over here? I probably am. Which is always my luck. Ah, there we go. Knowing my luck, the orb, or sphere, or whatever, is probably in the corner here. Yep, I knew it. And voila! Free energy! Thank you, Spyro. I found this shiny thing mixed up with our lightning stones. Please, take it as a reward. Thank you. Now that this annoying place is done. Okay, but it's so annoying. Curses! We can move on to more pressing matters, which are not really all that much more pressing matters. Like windmills to destroy, and robots as well. And running into... Ah, everything. That damages us. Hello, goodbye. Hmm. Ah, an extra life. Lovely. Okay, that was just stupid. Okay, that was not very stupid. 
I have no idea how we even got that life. Hmm. Nothing over here. Be careful. Wait for it. There you go. Let's get the. Thank you. Be careful not to fall off the ledge into the bottomless pit of... I don't know what. Ah, we should have enough to have power for the... Super speed power up back a little earlier. Something, I don't know. I do not know. That was stupid. Playing nice, however, is not stupid. However totally random it may seem. And that should be it. Good. You can never seem to get in line. Thank you, Spyro. You've deactivated all of the electric barriers. We've been guarding this talisman from the gear grinders. Please, take it as a reward. Oh, thank goodness you guarded that talisman. Otherwise, it would have been grinded a lot. And no one likes to grind the talisman because that way it serves us no purpose because it loses its magical power or something. I have no idea. I have no idea. Okay, it's gonna be a bit tricky. Okay, the first two ones not. Really. Excuse me for a moment. Okay, I'm back. Now then. Use the super speed power up to break the slightly larger windmill so you can stop the largest windmills from moving. A lot. They still move, but very slowly. Alright, these next two ones are a bit trickier. Only a bit. Because we need a sharp turning angle here. Knowing my like, I'm probably gonna fail. Yep, sharper turning angle. Okay, that was close, but who cares? I died, God done. Spyro, do you see that big building over there? No. The gear grinders are using it to steal our electricity. Please help us by shutting down the machinery inside. Didn't I already get rid of them all? Eh, in any case. We'll have to glide over there. Through a complex... Gliding puzzle thingy. Platforming. This is a platforming game. Did you expect platforming? I hope you did. Because otherwise you wouldn't be prepared for things like this. Alright, there's nothing over there. This is actually our way back. Yep. Timing. Timing. Not too difficult. Definitely not to fall down here. This next section is a bit trickier. But not much. Spyro, you've done well so far. You can have this little trinket for good luck. If you have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just give me my orb. The next glides get tricky. You'll have to use your hover maneuver to make them. Press the triangle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tutorials, Remember tutorials, to tutorials, even after you already had them like five times. Or maybe they're just reminders. Well, at least it's not as bad as in Portal games. In any case, take a moment to appreciate the sights. While we slowly move around. 
Look at the fine texture details on those rocks over there. And the gems, how well formed they are. And Spyro, the fluid animation. Truly the pinnacle of graphics, nothing can beat this. In any case, timing! Yep. Tricky. Spyro, help! The switch to turn off the gear grinder factory is in that room, but, um, it's awfully noisy in there. Oh, Spike, you're as useless as Spike. 400 out of 400. I know, I kinda like these sound effects. And it's shiny in here. Thanks for shutting down the factory. Here, I found this stuck between the gears. You can have it if you want. I'm surprised the gear grinders didn't find this one. Oh well, who cares as long as I get free stuff. Okay, it's not really free. Oh look, we're back here. And that's it. 